The Automat is the story of America's largest restaurant chain before McDonald's. It starts in the 1880s and it goes all the way to the 1990s, showing the evolution of a beloved American restaurant institution where everyone would go who lived or visited New York or Philadelphia. Somehow we turned this restaurant chain into sort of a character and watch its evolution over the course of about 100 years as told by Mel Brooks, Ruth Bader Ginsburg, Colin Powell, Carl Reiner, Elliot Gould, and then the families that ran this business. And the business was in their names. It was the Horn and Hard Art Automat. I spent a lot of time eating in my college cafeteria. It was a really wonderful place for me to go. And it got me curious to know more about where our school cafeteria came from. So in our school library, I was researching cafeteria history and that's how I came across the Automat. It was either an article or a book, but I somehow found it and, you know, went down the rabbit hole. I think it's helpful for people to hear how just in every, something that happens to you in everyday life how it might not seem like a lot, but how it can, you know, really be profound. I loved eating in my school cafeteria and I loved the sense of community that was there. And I recognized the Automat was an incredible community. I actually think that this film shows how it's good for us to, you know, reflect back on our memories. I think people who went to the Automat, they see this film and then they think about the Automat in a new light afterwards. They realize things that they didn't realize before about how social mixing is so, you know, valuable and important and beautiful and it, you know, makes people think, hmm, maybe we should do this again. Maybe, maybe we should all sit together, as Mel Brooks says, in the film it was too late and but he realized that he really missed it i think that probably a lot of people who have watched the movie aren't necessarily kind of the usual suspects for a historical kind of film but the automatic is such a special place you know across the board for all different kinds